Hello guys, welcome back to Gonna be looking at you for another video for Age Shadows. Welcome back to my channel. We are doing another line of arena session. Uh we're actually back on here. We're looking quite good for Marius. Um, got another five today. It did cost me 150 gems, obviously. So we're like um 17 away, so if we can get five a day. And then hopefully have this done by Sunday. After that, it's pretty much like uh, this one, which is ready to go. Uh, this one, which is sitting at 6,000. Then Sal, which again, which is already ready. I keep some left over and then buy something in the shop. Send the gear. I've got pretty much of Sandero oil. Sunday next week. No, this week for sure. And then I need to keep one of my keys. So really, I think after Sunday, I can fly through pretty much all of this. Um, and then get to the 81, right? I would like to see, I would like to give myself a week between the the missions and get to 80. I probably will spend a lot of gems just to fly through them. And so we can focus on this, like ASAP. After that, it's 40 Lyrina fights. For sure, this one will probably take me like a month to clear. For sure, because it's like 80. If I get lucky on a couple of Sundays, maybe it would do it a bit faster. Uh, it's going to cost me 150 gems a week, so like it's going to be quite expensive. And then after that is Lyrena tokens again, which will again we'll start collecting. Which will be the next like big, big push, probably for like top 800. And maybe 750. And then after that, it's pretty much set sailing after that, you know, get keep Hydro Key. Uh, so yeah, like I'm not too bothered about the the arena wins, if I'm honest, because I cleared the, the fate quite quickly. So I feel like I can clear this within two days if I'm quite active. Uh, but this one will be the problem after the one I'm already finished on. So uh, depending on RNG, um, I think it will take me about six weeks too clear um if i can get it faster that i'll be happy i'm just gonna pick some things from the shop um again do we uh, no it's not got the red right tome so yeah and then we're gonna do some of this in between so let's hit the refresh button there good luck to me uh so yesterday obviously we got like 40 percent win rate which wasn't great don't think there was much I could have really done in a couple of fights. Maybe the first one I definitely could. Oh, I've done better, and that's probably the one I could have done better as well. Mm. But hopefully, I mean, I was hoping to have a good session, right? <laughs> Gersling gets uh, gets Armads again. So we faced Kersling yesterday, and uh, he got Armads yesterday, and he's got Sigford, so. Like, super crazy for me to beat. Uh, so. Mm, yeah, it will be a interesting one for sure. Um, I have to go first. So, yeah, let's go like that. Chances of me winning this. Um, not high. <laughs> let's just say that. Not high indeed. I already know he's going to pull out Star Sage against me. Talking of the devil. No, no. Lower than that. Lower. Hmm. I already know I can't bomb his uh Star Sage. Uh lower. I'd say one percent.
Uh, I have an idea, but it depends on his last two picks. Nah, Sigford, no point. He's too fast for Sigford. Captain Stanley's like, he's top one in the live arena. For sure, he's top one. But I feel like his Armad is actually faster than my Sifu. Which is a problem. I'm going to work on Sifu the 6 star next, because it'll give me a bit more speed. It's taking his time. Probably ban Arbiter though. Yeah. If our man's is faster, I'm toast. If he cuts in, I'm toast. I need the Armad's pick to beat him. Told you. Gonna take Duchess. It's again the Marius is another problem. If I can get Marius instead of uh, Narcissus in this pick, then it really, really helps me. But uh, until I get Marius, I'm just it's gonna be after a case of uh, stick with it, right? So yeah. Um. Probably will ban Dark Smiles here. Oh, and he's just took UDK against me, which is brilliant. Chances me winning this now, because you're banned Dark Smiles, which was obvious. Uh, chances me winning this now. Hmm. 20% chance I'll win this. Yeah, Marius is massive, man. Especially against Sigford. He's really good against my Sigford because my Sigford's slow. I haven't got really good stone skin for him yet. Let's keep getting screwed over by Playroom. 100% lose? Yeah, probably. If he makes a mistake, I might win this. But he needs to make a mistake. If I can kill... I can queen kill, I can queen, oh man. Oh, I can kill her. Queen reaction propped. No one play versus me? No, it's easy win. I'm not very difficult to win. I've got good knowledge from Rena, just not very... I haven't got a lot of champions to choose from. Nah, I normally lose against Star Sage. I already know you got Star Sage, Boogie. If you get our mads and Star Sage, I'll just back out straight away. I won't even try these days. Pointless. Uh, Star Sage is too strong. That's all you need to do. You just need to win your fights. As long as you win your fights with Star Sage and Armads, you should never really lose them too. You got the best two P vs P champions in the game. I would put Star Sage in pinpoint though, so you don't get sheeped. I think you had yours in stone skin, right? Uh, told you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
I got lucky. The thing is, you can't judge anyone. Like, there's no point sitting here and be like, oh, I'm going to beat him because he's at 4,800. It's not at all. You can't be like that. Sometimes it's be easier to beat people in the top 250 because, like, they're just done shit ton of battles, you know? You did not... Uh, I did not even notice his score. Well, it's, it wasn't really memed at you, Rose. Like, I've seen other content creators that do videos, but like, oh, he's only 4,800, don't worry. And I'm like, dude. <laughs> Mo uh, most amateur thing you can do. Right, so we're facing go second here. Let's see who he brings in afterwards. Warlord can be a bit of a funny one to use. Monkey forced me. So the monkey move made me go the UDK of Duchess, right? Because then it means I don't have to focus about killing monkey all the time if UDK is on the pitch. Barbarian. Can be awkward. Uh can't see or I have a band Queen and Cora Sigford or Armads. 9% chance of ban Armads. Um and the mythical. Oh okay. He should be alright, like he should be alright against the Sonic set, because he's got two turn meter boost champions, so I don't think you need to worry too much. It's a bit of an odd one to ban Narcissus. Unless he's got Bolster there somewhere. It's the speed team, so I like, wouldn't say you need to worry about that. Unless he's worried about me getting blocked with Vive. Perfect start for him. Perfect start. Stripping stone skin. That's a bit annoying when he strips stone skin like that. I need to look at my Queen and Corey's resistance. It has no accuracy up, so... Maybe we can glyph it a little bit. I mean, it's a bit niche, isn't it? Uh, I mean, it depends on how fast he is then. Send you decay here. Come on, give me reset. We, oh, no reset for Sigford at all. Crazy. Monkey can be a problem for sure. Lower level league, so I can understand banning him. Most people don't know how to counter him. Uh, uh, I think he's still Oh, now you're screwed 
Oh, no way. Who did we get sheeped on? Wow. I actually might save him in his fight. I might just give him a win. That might just give him a win. Play the fear. Can't believe that. No, it's game over. It's game over. I slapped him. Hey, Ryan, how you doing, mate? Are you twenty-four thousand, twenty-four thousand dollars free to play? Yes. No, I'm just changing my name, bro. I'm just trying to stop people. A lot of people. I don't know if you're aware. Taking notes. I've seen about four or five content creators now taking notes. So, <laughs> including small streamers, bro. <gasps> and I'm like, I can see them playing me, right? And they're literally writing notes about me, and I'm like, bruh. So, if they're gonna write notes, I may as well make them write notes. <laughs> so at some point, they're gonna have like 10 different sets of notes just for me. And they'll be like, huh. Yeah. Honestly, it's becoming a factor now. People used to do it all the time in Platinum Arena as well, right? I don't know if it's really a factor in Platinum Arena, but now, as it was back in the day, I always had a good memory, so I can remember like most people's champions. Like once I start facing people like three or four times, I will know what I got. Like I know what Bio uses, Shinny uses, etc. Shinny, you just bomb. Straight up, just bomb him. He won't see it coming. So if I face Shinny, it's like okay, bomb. Yeah, he he only knew it as me because he faced me last night. And I haven't changed my name. I'm not going to change my name every day, but I will keep changing it frequently. Scratch is just the same thing. For that same reason. Hmm. The thing is, it doesn't matter if I take notes or not, I ain't being Kerslin, unless... The only way I'll beat Kersley is if I go first. If I get Armads, he's in a spot of trouble, and I think Kersley would probably admit that. I beat him before as well, I beat him on Edwin Pete's account. I feel like I'm just dead against his team, but. Well, that does help. What I really need, though, is Queen and Cora to really set Narciss. And Queen and Cora has to set Narciss twice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you got Enfeeble on me up for two turns. Oh, aren't I lucky, man? I beat Alex before, though. This is Sophia. I remember Alex. I beat him before. I feel like Alex actually has Sigbert. Sleep, horsey. Sleep. Have a break. Have a Kit Kat.
Not gonna lie, I need to kill Yumiko in like ASAP. Before she locks me out again. Well, I'd be really. Oh, Queen and Cora, three times. Do I reset? Queen, you're killing me. Oh, wow. Where's the reset, girl? How many sieges have I been so far for? I think Monkey is a bigger threat, to be honest, right now. But the thing is, if Queen Akora reset me by now, I'd actually would have won this. But this girl doesn't like to reset. There we go. Thank God for that. I went on way too long to ban Sausage. What? Oh, I hate these style of fights when I ban my Reviver. It's going to be annoying, isn't it? Banning Queen and Korra, second person tonight. Potentially, we just one shots me. E. The Sheep Taurus straight off the bat. Because it's got two weak affinities. If I weak it, I don't get backgrounds. Sigfoot can revive, yep. Yeah. He can. Problem is, he's dead. Now I have to wait till everyone else to die. I don't like it as much. Yes! Oh, that's a big help. I've not spent 50 at all. Jesus. I mean, not bad. Problem is now he's gonna stun me like a bitch. Hell no. Jesus Christ. I mean, Lisa has got no buffs. He's gonna do the AOE though, self passive. Cause I'm stunned. He spent 24 to be nice. Uh, wins this. Let's go win this. Ah. Good play from him. Wait, you're not going for Sigfoot? Just need you to do a bit more damage. I need to change your masteries. That was a bit nervous. Green and Cora. So frustrating when people do that to me. Ah, I really hate it. But like, who can I pick there instead? What's the problem? If I take Sigford, he counts me too early. If I take Dark Smiles, I'll probably bring Marishka. Abandon my Onuka. If I go Arbiter or Carnage, I have to commit to speed. If I have Marius, Marius is fits in that slot like so perfectly. It's the only one I think of it does. 
I'm gonna take UDK early, but it's too too early. If I take Queen and Cora there, that opens me up for bombs. Instead of Sifi. And they just take Sifi, you know, no chance. So he's got it's a pretty rough roaster. Uh, I took the wrong UDK. Um, I think he banned Sigfoot here. Should be easy win for him. Him and Queen and Chorus should be easy win. Ah. Uh, If it relates to Sigford, I'll have a chance of winning this. Alright, there goes my chance of winning. These are just straight my stone skin. For sure. Guaranteed. Hmm. Honestly, I hate facing Lasarius. If I'm honest. And I'm faster here, which is not good news for me either. Because there goes my reaction. Fuck. This guy is really slow. It's crazy because I knew it was going to go like this. So if I took bombs, I win this. Him another strip. Oh, he stripped the stone skin off my UDK. Bam. See him worse. This won't be an easy one to bomb. My main mistake here, bombing. I knew the last fight I should have bombed. This one I'll commit to the bombs. I feel like it's a bad mistake already. And start smiles. A weak affinity. Mm. I only like using bombs if I get armads. Oh, it's got bolster. Made the wrong decision again. It's got bolster. I ain't gonna be able to get through this. I ain't got enough attack. Makes sense now I took it. Ah, oh, Queen of Chorus got weak hit. Mm -hmm. Wait, has he made a mistake? Oh no, Queen of Cora has only got bombs on her for one turn. Why does she only get bombs on her for one turn? Resist it? Can't be resisted. I had accuracy up.
Don't know why. Yeah, survived. Resisted one bomb? How? I think we have to ban nice on this one. Most of a new key took. Yeah, so he took Lady M this time because he's trying to counter attack me and I've already just changed the strategy. So he took Queen to stop me trying to bomb him. Now he's going to go after. Because he thinks I'm going to take after. Huh, interesting. I have to ban Nisi here. Maybe thinks I'm gonna take Dark Smiles. I could take Dark Smiles. Challenge for speed. Up to six star blessing, no point really. Can't take C fee. I mean if he has Dark Smiles, I'm in trouble. Getting bombed. Sigford wouldn't be a bad pick either. Monkey, when I got UDK. Nice, okay. Take that. He's got a UDK now, isn't he? Okay, if UDK, if Katrixia doesn't lock out, Dark Smiles should be okay. Might win the return attack in here. See you later, Pally. Thanks for the luck. I got lockout on everyone and stripped my stone skin. Brilliant. No way. Lucky guy. Huh? Fuck. And you had to go break stone skin, huh? this I think I just made a crucial mistake and I didn't think it through I know what mistake I just made Might get away with it. Might get away with this. I can't bomb him yet. I gotta reset that as well. I could put Monkey on cooldown, but I could potentially kill him. But I have to on cooldown.
see if we get sheeped or not. Go on, baby. Ah, patience. The mistake that I made is I revived Dark Smiles too fast. Should have played the A1 on the cooldown, went for a block revive on, and uh, on Monkey, right? I swear I should have played it. Well, I thought it was my downfall anyway, but... So it wasn't too bad in the end. Why are so many people opening stone today? I know this guy. First time we met. PC member. Is in the top two clans. Because it's working. They had our turn on at all. Alright, he's gonna try and bomb me. I can't counter because I ain't got Mushka. I have to face our mats. We can try and make it difficult though. This means you get banned CP, right? I've always seen it, bro. I've always seen it. Okay, I think I know how to kind of make this tricky, more or less. I can probably slow him down. Yeah, but small amount of people, mate. Uh, 19 AA, welcome. Yeah, I've pretty much lost this one, I'm gonna lie. Uh Nick would actually comes in. If I, I have to get our mad's pick of this one. If I get our mad's pick. Nah, had you no good. Took Nick Rid because he protects one of my new curves, which will be sick thirds. Might get lucky with a revive combat rounds. And he's got no life harvest. But it's still really risky. And he banned the Queen and Cora. So he's letting Sifi as well. It's going to be an interesting fight. Really weird. There's no point playing resistance lead. They've got bolster on anyway, so. Did we get lucky with protection? Kind of a little bit. I bomb Sigford through the bolster. I didn't even think he could do that. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, didn't think he could do that.
GG. There's something I could have done in that fight. Uh, these two fights, I could have done better in all fairness. I started off really strong for that last hurdle. First session, four wins out of five. Second session, I couldn't do nothing here, to be honest. Put my hands up. Couldn't do much against Kersman. It's one of these fights, again, if I get the Armad's pick, I can probably do better. Uh, it's one of the fights, you get Armad's, so you can do better, right? It's just a shame. We'll get one minute, I don't want to face him again. I can still potentially get 2 4. I could still potentially get 60% in the next fight. We've got three places so far. Only three. Still so far away from our pass or pass. I would like to win because I would obviously I would like to win, but I would like to finish 5,200 this session. Also, as well, like I do feel in two of them fights, we've got Marius. It's a much easier fight. I just have to make my Marius like 320 now. We got Armand's pick. Not being able to use bombs as efficient as well today. Not really had the opportunity, except from one of the fights. Star Sage. I think three of the fights where I've actually had Armad's pick. They still had sausage. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, we'll go speed. I mean, it's last fight, right? I got 50% win rate already, so. Sigfords. He's got quite a few sheepy sheepy. I mean, if he lets in Armads, it's not there in the world to still potentially win if he lets in Armads. If he doesn't let in Armads, as long as he has a high resistance, it should be okay. Monkey can be a problem for bombs as well. Eternal Fairness because of self revive and um, bombs are always squishy. Mm. Imagine if you had a bomb champion who could do bomb, but also like try to play the weekend. We don't need to play the weekend against two of them. Ha. Oh. Think. Okay, interesting. They just got monkey to deal with. Sleep. I mean, when it works, it works, right? It was risky. Bombs always risky. I didn't pay off here. I could have bombed this guy here. This one, bombs in pay off. What well, ones? I need to build, I need to build a third bomb champion because I'll build a third, <clears throat> if I build a third one, then, um, huh, they have to ban, if the bomb one band, if they bar, if they banned one bomb champion, fair enough, I got one, 
So if I come in with three bomb champions, Dark Smiles get banned all the time, I guarantee you. So good and bads. Anyway, we're going to finish today's session with 6% win rate. I'll take it. We're going to be finishing on at uh, 841, which is a eight places I think we gained. Recap looking onto the fights. Kerslin, I'm going to beat Kerslin if I go first, potentially. Some way I'm going to win that one. Uh, these ones, I think we're looking when these fights, everything else went very around to plan. This one here, should have really gone bombs. This one here, should have stuck with go second, so if they make better decisions there, potentially I'll win it. And so there's not much I can really do there. Who else? That's it. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I've been Green. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.